This winter's mild winter has caused problems for annual events that Minnesotans have grown accustomed to attending, and those events are having to adjust accordingly. Reporter Sammy Holliday sat down with Chuck Zwilling, the president and founder of Ice Fest, an event that holds several world records for ice carousels, to discuss their contingency plan for their event in Little Falls. Every year, Chuck Zwilling and his family think of ways to one-up themselves from the year before for Ice Fest. This year, their plans have to be tempered as the mild winter may not allow enough quality ice to be produced on Green Prairie Fish Lake in Little Falls. Whether there is enough ice or not, Ice Fest will take place. We have zero concerns because we're going to do it on land if we don't have 16 inches of quality ice. Obviously, we won't cut ice carousels, but all of the other activities can still happen without being on a lake. Those activities include over a half dozen winter pastimes that can put anyone in a festive mood. Besides the carousels, we have the hockey, the curling, the dog sled rides, Santa sleigh rides, human bowling, human foosball. You know, we've got a finished sleigh that gets built. So all of those activities will still go on the same. It'll just be on dry land instead of on water. Even with the contingency plan in place, Zwilling is optimistic that enough ice can be produced thanks to the recent drop in temperature. If there isn't 16 inches of ice by third week in February, that may be the first time in like forever. So I'm very confident that, that we're going to have lots of ice. I think the old timers would tell you that when it's this cold, it's an inch a day gets made. I wanted to check before the cold snap and we have six inches of ice. And so I'm going to check again in about 10 days or a week and see how much ice actually got made in that because there isn't much snow out there. There's only about two and a half inches of powder on there. So there isn't a lot of insulation. So there will be a lot of ice being made. Hopefully this cold can cause that much needed deep freeze. Reporting in Brainerd, Sammy Holiday, Lakeland News. The 7th Annual Ice Fest will take place over two days, the 17th and 18th of February. For more information, you can visit the website on the screen. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.